why is it okay for women to feel entitled to being protected and provided for, but it is wrong for men to feel entitled to sex and intimacy? Why is it okay for a woman to feel entitled to be protected and provided for, but it's wrong for a man to feel entitled to sex and intimacy? Why are there some women who shame men for being horny when testosterone is a male hormone? Why must men put up with female hormones being emotional and crazy, but women can't put up with male hormones being horny? When someone commits a crime, do you blame the criminal or do you blame society? When somebody commits a crime, do we blame the criminal or do we blame society? Well, if a woman is attacked in public and a man is attacked in public, who do you think is more likely to be rescued? If a woman and a man are attacked in public, who is more likely to be rescued? When was the last time you apologized? What was the last thing that you apologized for? Do women have a right to be afraid of men when 80% of all violent crime is done by men? Do women have a right to be afraid of men when 80% of violent crime is done by men? How is that different than fearing certain races based on statistical data? How is that different than fearing certain races because of statistical data? Why is it okay for women to be sexist but not racist? Why do you think it's okay for women to be sexist but not racist? Why is it when a man cheats, he's a cheater, but when a woman cheats, it's because she's not satisfied? Why is it that when a man cheat, he cheats, he's a cheater, but when a woman cheats, she's not satisfied in the relationship? Who takes more accountability, men or women, and why? Women! Who takes more accountability? Men or women? Men. Men. Why is male sexuality so stigmatized? Why do you think male sexuality is so stigmati stigmatized? So if a guy cheats, can he blame society? And so if a guy cheats, can he blame society? Would you agree that the best means of physical protection in our society would either be owning a gun or calling the police? What is a better form of protection? Owning a gun or calling the police? Why do you think that men are still expected to be protectors when a woman is just as capable of calling the police or firing a gun as a man? Why are men expected to be protectors when women are just as capable of firing a gun or calling the police? Would you trust a female cop to stop a sexual assault? Would you trust a female cop to stop a sexual assault? Also, I want to give credit where credit's due. A lot of these questions are from It's Complicated Channel. You guys should go follow him. Oh, I love that channel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So a lot of these, uh, he's very good at what he does. I steal them from him. I did get a lot of these questions from the It's Complicated channel. Literally, this man has the best questions and the best content. So if you want to give him a follow, please do so. Or wait, I'm on YouTube. A subscribe, please do so. <laughs> um, because I did, I want to give credit where credit is due.